Thank you for watching Quick and Easy Meals, the Keto Series. We hope to provide you with ideas for keto meals that you can make at home. There are a lot of health benefits to keto other than just losing weight and controlling your A1C. So if you want to eat healthy, you're probably going to have to start making these meals at home since there are no keto restaurants that I know of. So stay tuned and let's get started making keto meals. I hope you enjoy the series. Okay, we're gonna make another really nice keto meal. And this little bit of ingredients is gonna make a fabulous meal for you. So let's go over the ingredients. We're gonna get cod. You could do uh, fresh cod, but they were out of fresh cod at the store. So I had to get the frozen cod. Uh, you're gonna get shredded Parmesan cheese. We're gonna get for our side dish, we're just gonna do steamed vegetables. We're gonna do, um, you could do spinach. I had thought about spinach, but we're gonna do that. Uh, we're gonna get smoked uh, paprika or regular paprika, your choice. We're gonna use some uh, virgin olive oil, some salt, some um, parsley, and some black pepper. And this little bit of ingredients is gonna really make a fabulous meal. This is gonna be called um, crunchy cheese coated cod. So, country cheese coated cod so let's get started because i am ready okay first you want to preheat your oven to 200 degrees then we're going to mix in our ingredients we're going to do the cheese uh, a cup of uh, parsley cheese we're going to do a tablespoon or so of parsley and then we'll do a two teaspoons of paprika should be enough there and then we're going to add in one fourth teaspoon of salt which i'm going to also eyeball and then we'll do a tablespoon of olive oil and then we'll do tablespoon of olive oil and mix this up really well and this we will put on top of the cod we'll also brush some olive oil on the cod we're going to use Next, we're going to prepare our fish. I put it in a little glass dish because we're going to kind of paint it. We're going to paint olive oil on top of it and then we're going to uh, put the um, ingredient ingredients that we just mixed up. We're going to put it on top of it and press it down. And I think having it in the glass dish kind of makes it easier. So we're just going to paint that over and then we're going to put this ingredients on top. Kind of pat that down in there. Parchment paper was what I was thinking about. That's we're gonna line a cookie sheet with parchment paper. And, and if you like to add some pepper, you could add some pepper on it. I like a little bit of pepper on And then we'll put it on the cookie sheet with the parchment paper so that it does not stick. Let's see, let's do that again there. So we'll do the second one the same way. And remember, hopefully your oven is preheated to 200 degrees. Now, once you get done, uh, putting on the uh, seasonings. It only took about five minutes. And now it goes into the oven for about 20 minutes. So your oven is on uh, 200 degrees, waiting for it to be, uh, you're gonna put this in there and let the fish get flaky and then it's done. Okay, this took about 10 minutes. I want to say I, I, I did say put it on 200, but probably 300 is better. I remember I was cooking something, so I used 200, but it's a little flaky. We cooked it on 350 for 10 minutes. Now let's plate this thing up and I get to eating dinner. Uh, but again, it took five minutes to put the ingredients together, about 10 minutes to cook. That's 15 minutes and you're eating a well-balanced, healthy keto meal. Quick, fast, and easy. So here you go, a nice quick meal. It took about 20, 20 minutes to put together. And I just wanna show you, I wanna share with you one keto tip today. When you're thinking about your side dishes, you wanna get, and you're using vegetables, use the vegetables that grow above ground. Uh, that's why I don't have any carrots in here and that's why I don't have mashed potatoes because I would have in the past used mashed potatoes and fish would have been a nice meal. But now we're going with broccoli and cauliflower and cod. Uh, so there you go. Eat up 
and, and enjoy. Thanks for watching. Until next time, have a great week. Thank you for watching the Quick and Easy Meals channel. Eat healthy, be healthy, stay healthy. Have a great week.